secret. The decision clears the way for the National Archives to provide hundreds of pages of documents to the House January 6th committee. Justice Clarence Thomas was the lone justice who said the court should have granted the former president's motion. Now, meteorologist Jamie Jarosik and your Storm Team 2 forecast. If you are planning a walk today, keep in mind how cold it's going to be this morning. Temperatures have dropped into the teens. We've got mid and upper teens right now, and it feels even colder with the wind chill. Wind chill single digits. As we head through lunchtime, it will be 23 degrees. We'll have some sun mixed with clouds, and then mid to late afternoon, just mid-20s. That's it for our high, 25 at 4 o'clock. Still going to feel more like 13 degrees with the wind chill. So uh, dealing with much colder air today behind that cold front that came through yesterday. And it's even harder to take because yesterday we were up near 50 degrees. Lots of sunshine will be around on Friday, but it's still going to be cold, and that cold theme will continue into the weekend. Looks very cold with even the slight chance of a snow shower later in the day Sunday. Now, precipitation chances are low, but they're not zero. Well, they will be zero today, tomorrow, Saturday, but Sunday they do come up to 20%, so a snow shower looks fairly light, would be possible later in the day. And then we'll have a better chance of some scattered snow showers as we head towards Tuesday of next week. This morning, there's a little bit of light snow, some flurries coming across Wayne County, Indiana, and some of the clouds that are out there. But we saw skies clear out over a good part of the Miami Valley, so we really are starting off nice and bright in most of our counties. High pressure building in from the west will keep things quiet today, keeps that northerly flow going, so the colder air is continuing to move in behind this front that is now pulling away from us. A check of future track shows at times we'll have bands of clouds come through, but overall looks like a partly sunny and quiet day. Five o'clock for the drive home, looking partly sunny and dry. And overnight, actually, a little bit of clearing occurs. Tomorrow morning, a few more clouds develop, but they quickly dissipate as the morning goes on. So we're looking mostly sunny going through noon Friday and late in the day Friday. Still pretty clear here at five o'clock for that drive home from work. Here's your forecast today. It's going to be partly sunny, breezy, and colder with a high of 25 with winds coming in from the north pretty much around 10 miles per hour. We're going to see wind chills in the teens through the day. Overnight, with clear sky and the winds dying down a bit, we'll drop to a very cold 8 degrees, especially those single digits showing up in the eastern half of the Miami Valley. And then tomorrow's mostly sunny and continued cold with a high of 24 degrees. Over the weekend, we'll have morning temperatures in the teens, highs both days close to 30. There's that slight snow chance Sunday in your Storm Team 2 seven-day forecast. Monday will finally go above freezing, but it's brief. Tuesday's high is freezing. We'll have a few more snow showers work through and then a bigger push of cold air for Wednesday.